What's going on YouTube? This is Jeffrey Howell for Black Gun Owners and Education. I'd like to take the time today to talk to you all about a product that was brought to my attention and I want to take, I want to actually try it out and see exactly if it's as good as I've heard it is. The product is the Super Nano Detergent Bore Cleaner. This product is supposed to be pretty decent and pretty so good. So I've got it right here and my farm I decided I want to try it on is my Smith & Wesson Governor. Normally we're quick to try, you know, different products on, on our semi-autos. I want to try it on my Smith & Wesson Governor because, as you can see, I've got it pretty dirty. And I intentionally got it dirty so I can test this product out and see if it actually, you know, holds up to the hype. If you look along here, it's like, when I say this bad boy is dirty, it's all dirty all up in there. So, I'm actually put some work on this bad boy here. So, let me go ahead and put my gloves on and let's get to work on this. Alright, get that in there. I'm gonna get a good bit in there and get it get it up in there so it can actually do something. Okay, get up in there. Not bad. Get on up in there. Not bad. Get a few good swipes up in there. Make sure I get it get in the cylinders real good there. Alright. Then now I can put the top. Nope, we wanna to get into the barrel too. Matter of fact, don't don't double dip just like you do with your chips. Don't double dip, alright? That'd be nasty. I know y'all about I know y'all about to talk about me. I know y'all do out there in YouTube land. So since I get it nice and wet. And since I can't go from that end, maybe I can because this is plastic. Yep, this plastic, I can do it that way. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Pull it back through. Yeah, it's all nice and plasticky. So now that I got that like that, I can go ahead and put this top back on and squeeze some of the solution on these cloths and get it all on the gun because I got to really make sure I soak it. And I was told per direction to make sure that I soak it real good and let it sit for a while since I, 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 told, I warned them how, how dirty I was going to get the gun. It's like, all right, with that case, you better let, let, it, let it sit for a while, so. Let me make, whoa, I'm gonna tell you now, look. I'm trying to just put the solution on there, right? If you look, look at that right there. All I did was just wipe it to put the solution on, and this stuff is coming like right off. Look at that. I'll be doggone. I was told I was gonna have to let it sit. Doesn't appear to be true. It looks like it's cleaning this bad boy very well. Yo, look at this. I am really amazed at how, Wow, okay. This is actually cleaner, getting it cleaner than when I actually cleaned it the first time when I use another cleaner that I use all the time. So I may be onto something new here, y'all. Wow, I was gonna just let it soak like he told me to do, but I can't lie to you. It's cleaning it off with the wipe, just like it said it would. Wow, yo, that is impressive. Y'all remember how dirty this, this was earlier? Look at that. Man. Okay, yeah. Jefferson. Oh, wow. And look at here. Y'all saw how dirty that was, right? Look how clean it already is. And I will tell you, I used another cleaner before, and it did not come off this easy at all. Look at that. Yo. All right, so... I ain't gonna act like I'm like I'm that impressed, but I'm, I'm very impressed. We ain't gonna act like I'm not. Look at this, yo. I am thoroughly impressed with this board cleaner. This has really cleaned this gun very well. And I've really got, and when I say I got this gun dirty, y'all, I mean, I've literally shot this gun. I, had, I wanna say I went to the range back to back to back using the federal premium triple up buck um, 410 shells in here. I used the Fiocchi 45 long coat in here, the American Eagle, American Eagle 45 long coat, the, what else I used, the American Eagle uh, 45 ACP. I mean, I, and I just kept shooting various rounds out of here nonstop for like the past, I wanna say about the past month or so. And I was trying to get it as dirty as I possibly could just to see how well this cleaner is. And I will tell you this much, for this cleaner to be environmentally safe, as they say, because it also says that it's 
uh, no ammonia, no alcohol, safe for indoor use, uh, safe for shotguns, rifles, pistols, and revolvers. And I am really impressed. And I'm just using it haphazardly right now just to put, put some uh, cleaner on there just to see how well it's gonna do. And it's like, now see how dirty this is back here? Hold on, I wanna make sure y'all see how dirty this is before I even start cleaning it. That's dirty as I don't know what, right? Now you see it. Let's see, let's see if it takes it off. All right, now you don't. Wow. Talk about impressive. Yeah, I'm impressed with this cleaner. Gotta let my man Stan know that what he turned us on to is a very good product. So if it cleans the revolver just like this, I can imagine how well it cleans the semi-autos as well, the pist semi-auto pistols. Yo. Man, oh man, I was not expecting this. I was not expecting it to be this easy to clean, I, I'll be honest. When I said I really got this gun dirty, I mean that. I mean, I was shooting everything out of here. I mean, I grabbed a little, uh, grabbed a little, uh, uh, as much ammo as I could, as much different style ammo for this, because I knew this would be the main gun I was gonna use in order to do the review on, and I knew how dirty it would get, because this, this is one of my only uh, pistols that's not all black, so that's what I wanted, I wanted to actually be seen on here. And yo, this cleaner went to work on this bad boy, yo. All right, we'll go ahead and finish cleaning it all, cleaning it all up and give it a good wipe down. No, y'all don't wanna see that boring part. And I'll show you the finished product, y'all. All right, YouTube, I'm back after fully cleaning the gun. And man, it is immaculate. Look how clean this gun is, yo. When I say this gun is clean, there's almost like, I feel, I feel almost like an understatement. Look how clean it is. Like really, like really, really clean. It is ridiculous how clean this gun is compared to how it was before. Look at this. This gun is, look, look how shiny it is. So what it does is it, it leaves a, a, a very extremely light coating, like a protected on it. So look, look at this, look at the actual end of that barrel. This was actually, the, the actual muzzle here was, uh, was dirty as heck and I actually just Wiped it all clean too, it was real dirty. So look at this, man. This gun is actually back to showroom ready. So, what do Jeffrey Howell think about the Nano, Super Nano Detergent Bore Cleaner? You already know. It definitely gets a thumbs up from me and I think I will be using it quite regularly now. Just look at this. Why would I not use it? This gun is back to like new status. Look at this. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, y'all. This is Jeffrey Howell for Black Gunners in Education. We appreciate your support. We appreciate you coming by the channel and checking us out. And until next time, because you know this is going to be a next time, signing off, see y'all at the range. Peace out.